sure we'll be cutting more stuff. Yeah, I just don't, I don't really, I don't need them. Yes. There you go. Oh, there's a brake line here. That's attached to the, uh... Um... Well, hell, we're not going to use this again, so I probably... could safely cut that. The brake line? Yeah, because we're going to replace all these. Yeah, probably a good idea. Yeah, for sure. That one's still caught, eh? Yeah. Is it? Oh, how about this one here? Yeah. <laughs> Did we ever try taking that off? No. That holds the uh, master on, I think. Nope. Oh, that should just be right. Oh, okay. 9 16 I, I don't know. I can't eyeball that stuff. That's my theory. So in order to remove the body, we have to either take out this bolt, I believe. Oh, if I can angle it properly. Take out this bolt, and then we should be able to remove the steering column and avoid removing the steering wheel. Is it turning? Yeah. I believe that's it. I think that's the pinch that I think that's the pinch that just holds it in there and squeezes it, but... Yeah, see it's not... Uh... Now I don't know, if, I don't think we should have to take that off. Hey, try, just try pulling the whole wheel thing back. Yeah, exactly. It kind of seems like maybe you're making some progress. <laughs> that's reassuring. It kind of seems like you're making I think you are. Just keep going? Yeah. Try kind of doing this with it, like kind of as you pull it. Yeah. Honestly, I can't tell. Hold here, one sec. Push the, the, the sleeve down, the shaft, this. Uh, just, yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, so that. that. Oh, did we just loosen this? Yeah, I think so. Okay. I'm going to get the brass hammer. Let's see if we tap the steering wheel off. Okay. You know what? Why don't you Google uh, how to remove uh, CJ, CJ3 steering column? Remove it. I bet it's going to say get pulley in the adapter. So the... The problem that we're having is that in the manual you're supposed to remove the steering wheel, but you need a specific adapter, and we don't have the adapter. Well, so far nothing's happened, so. Oh, her hands are taking a beating today. The plus on. Yeah, I know. Yeah, so we'll see what kind of pullers we have. Like maybe we have a claw puller. Okay. I'll try a little bigger horseshoe. Alright. We got the horseshoe yeah. for good luck. Yeah. Gotta figure some way to collect connect the arms. Like once they're in here. Like we need something to go. Yeah. Yeah, let's go. Yeah. 
Was this horseshoe for this, or was it just a horseshoe you had laying around? It was the horseshoe I had laying around. Well, it can't go through there, because there's no hole in there. The only thing I'm scared of was these arms snapping and it's the whole thing flying into my face. What happened? Nothing. Oh, what happened? It popped off and then... But it didn't pop off. Might need a new nut. For the steering wheel? Yeah. Alright. I'm sure it's pretty generic. This one, I think it's going to happen again. I got an yeah, idea though. Yeah, this one's starting to warp as well. Okay, I got an idea. How about we put something across those two? Oh, yeah, like a little yeah. metal beam or whatever? A little like piece of metal to go across? I think these are bearing caps for some kind of, we think for a uh, 4 GAA. Okay. Anyways, we, we've commandeered them to use as our. Was our puller neck, and I think um, ooh, we have a modicum of chance of success. No signs of slipping. <laughs> also, no sign. No signs of pop it off. So with the steering wheel, the uh, camera cut out as we were pulling it off, and what we did is we just ended up whacking it with a hammer. We. Uh, tried the pulley system to the point where it was tight and we didn't we were a little bit too frightened to keep cranking it off so we just whacked it with a hammer and it bust off and we didn't break it too bad so yeah that's what we missed oh, a red bull too. never hurts guy shows up with a few uh, sugar-free red bulls too just saying never hurts Going the extra weight of the hammer. No, no, no. Wait for your best way to lift this. I'm just gonna lift it to see if it goes. Yeah. Definitely. I think it's gonna go. <laughs> yeah. We need to get the back up and then just. Yeah. Right. Oh. Got me somewhere. One down. Where did it go? It just, uh, sure it broke. Wait. It's gone, man. Uh, don't know where it went. Don't know where it went. It's a later problem, man. I feel it is. Okay. So, uh, yeah, we're just going to try to obviously clear this from those. throw one of those in the buckets these so just so we know what they had in here sure some kind of rubber neoprene gasket just to guess keep from squeaking <laughs> we left the bracket that wasn't attached oh somebody tack welded it to the frame that's part so, of the line all right so we figure next is power wash We're trying to clean up this gunk yeah and then more disassembly Okay. Well, we want to take the whole, we got to take the transfer case out, yeah. take the drive shafts off, yeah. um, take the shocks off. Um, oh, let's put the wheel on so we can steer. 
Oh, what did I do with those bolts? Save it for here. Dummy. And, and I meant me. Three half inches. Do we save any? Oh yeah, yeah. they'll be on the, in the bucket probably. Well, maybe I'll start putting some in this. Uh... Do you show them all in here? Ah. So we may have to top the uh, steering wheel back in. Yeah. Oh, you're aware of this. Okay. I think it should be, yeah, it should be tapered to spline. Yeah. It's like, yeah. Um, we're looking for one more of these, this size. All this stuff's pretty cheap. Ah, there you go. That's the size of this thing. It's even lighter. We'll see how the drive back. Yeah. 